Hello, niacin or vitamin B3 is one of the eight B vitamins that's highly needed by the human body just to operate. And in fact, if someone doesn't consume enough of this stuff, all types of bad things can happen. To give you a couple ideas on this, something like scurvy may occur. Now, this is a, a disease that uh, really plagued a lot of sailors back in time. Basically, it kind of means like loosening teeth, uh, causes nerve damage, uh, convulsions, death. That's all it has to do with scurvy. Pellagra is another medical condition that may happen. And that results really in the four Ds. Uh, diarrhea, dermatitis, dementia, and death. Also, beriberi may occur if someone doesn't consume enough of uh, vitamin B3. That's like uh, results in mental confusion, speech problems, paralysis, stuff like that. Uh, and what's interesting about beriberi is that in 1905, a gentleman named William Fletcher discovered there are certain nutrients in the husk of rice that prevent this disease. And this pretty much led to the discovery of vitamins in general. Then someone named Casimir Funk kind of took his findings and created the term. So the, the disease or the health medical condition, beriberi, which was a huge problem uh, back in time, the early 1900s, kind of led to the discovery of vitamins. Also, rickets can happen without enough of uh, niacin, which really softens bones. So, as you can see, it's pretty important. To, besides preventing all these problems, uh, it can also do some huge improvements to someone's health. Uh, did you know that some doctors actually prescribe this vitamin to, to patients with high cholesterol? There's evidence that it can help with arthritis, memory, skin care, heart disease, just tons of other benefits. I could go on and on and listen to them. Just take my word for it and just take enough of this stuff. Now you can easily acquire niacin through eating fish, chicken, beef, fresh green bees. And now I strongly recommend taking a good supplement to be safe. The nutritional quality of the food that's available to us really has diminished because of chemicals, packaging, and cooking. Supplements also offer many other huge advantages like uh, antioxidants and some herbs. And of course, it's easy to take and convenient too. Now, of course, not everything is blue skies and rainbows and lollipops when it comes to supplements. There's some dangers and pitfalls to make your life somewhat easier because I'm sure you're a pretty busy person. I've actually kind of created this guide that could uh, walk someone through what to look for in a supplement brand and, and what to avoid. Now, just reading this guide, which can take a very short amount of time, can enable you to get a, a supplement that not only has the best price, but provides the most benefits with the least risk, which is very, very valuable. Oh, and it's completely free. So you really have no excuse not to at least check it out. And you can view this free guide by simply clicking the link directly below this uh, video. And I hope you enjoy it. Uh, thank you so much for watching and take care.